arrived in Denver Airport and I'm about to go to baggage claim, pick my suitcase up because I brought, I had free luggage included, so I brought a luggage bag full of winter clothes because it's cold, and then explore the city. So yeah, welcome to week five in California. Mental. Getting the train into Denver now. My hostel were really good because they actually sent me an email with all the instructions of how to get the train from the airport to the hotel. So it's pretty ideal. Save me some money on a, on a lift because lifts here are stupid expensive. Stupid expensive. super cute room and this is my bed no one's here right now so mask is off but I'm excited to explore I've put my name down for the pub crawl tonight to try and meet some people this room's actually really nice I've missed staying in hostels I'm ready I've signed up for the pub crawl and I've got changed into this top I think it's a bit more go reality very snowy. We made it back from the snowstorm luckily 
and now we're going to see a last minute spontaneous hockey game Dem what is it Denver Avalanches versus someone else I don't know but let's go <laughs> And we won the game last night, which was such a cool experience. But today's gonna to be like a day just exploring Denver itself. I need to get my nails redone because these have been on for like a month and they're growing out. I need to come off. I get my nails redone, just explore Denver. Cute toilet in the background there. I'm currently in the hostel. Bathroom, just finished my makeup. Anyway, yeah, I'm exploring Denver. And then tomorrow I'm seeing a friend and going to Rocky Mountain National Park. So, yay! <laughs> So I just went to get my nails done at an appointment that I booked on the messaging service and I got there and they were like, oh yeah, the lady that runs the messaging service is out of state right now and basically didn't inform them so they hadn't got a room for me today so I can't get them done. Which is annoying. Luckily it wasn't a complete waste of a journey though because there's a hard rock cafe uh, right opposite the nail bar and my dad collects shot glasses from there so I'm going to go buy him one and explore this area but my nails need doing so bad. My friend, uh, <laughs> it's like the great, it is the Great Wall of China. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, go for it, go. I'm dead. I can't. Okay, girl, are you ready to party? I'm ready to party. <laughs> I'm ready to party. <laughs> that 
that's fucked. That's so funny. <laughs> AM, but I'm up and out the hostel. I'll move back to the airport after a super fun weekend. Thank you, Colorado and Denver. It's been pretty sick. But yeah, flight back to California now and back to reality, I guess, which is quite fun still. to watch the sunset which I'm excited about because I've not been there before um, and that is it, that is what I'm up to so enjoy the view <laughs> was so nice tonight oh my gosh it was yeah it was beautiful as you, I, as you saw it was like right over the cliffs it was just a nice place to get away to but I've just taken my nails off my fingers are disgusting right now but I couldn't get them done in Colorado as I mentioned they hadn't, hadn't booked me in even though I booked it and um yeah I didn't want to pay California prices and they were getting really long so I just decided to take them off so that's going to be fun getting these back back to normal but hopefully not won't take too long um I'm working full time this week as well because uh, this, one of the, uh, the preschools closed because of a couple of COVID cases. So I'm working basically the entire week um, with the little boy. So yeah, just it's you know, I've come back from Colorado and I'm going straight back into sort of full full time hours this week because of COVID. Hopefully, uh, you know, COVID doesn't doesn't keep getting in the way of things. So I start class next week, so I need to be able to do that. Um, but I'm definitely in a very whirlwind of emotions. One minute I'm like feeling great, one minute I'm feeling pretty shitty. So still figuring out my emotions, still on this weird roller coaster. I mean, obviously feeling emotions isn't a bad thing, um, but it's definitely something that I'm, you know, trying to, trying to, um, what's the word, you know, move forward with and, you know, keep going, even though some days I'm literally there, like, I don't feel, I don't feel like it at all. Yeah. It's not, it's not a bad thing, it's just a lot of change. I know I'm at a different part of my life now than I've been and I have been before when I've travelled and stuff. So yeah, I've just gotta keep pushing through it. Um I'm just sad my nails are taken off to be honest. I'm not gonna lie, I've had nothing to report this week really since getting back from Colorado, so it's a little bit a little bit quiet. God my face is still so puffy. Don't even care. I'm puffy and I'm bunged up. I was sick yesterday. Well, there was it yesterday, Wednesday, Tuesday evening, Wednesday. 
um, I felt a bit better today, so I was back to work today. Um, went to get a COVID test with the little boy and then took him to Half Moon Bay, played at the beach and stuff. Um, I did a COVID test and my bunged up nurse is not COVID, but it's um, we still went to get a PCR because he has to get on for school. Um, so I thought I might as well get one, um, but I definitely felt better today. I just looked like an absolute potato. Yeah, nothing to report pretty much since Colorado because I came back, worked a little bit, got sick. So I did finish you, you know, the season you. I finished that uh, today whilst being sick or yesterday whilst being sick. Um, watched most of it yesterday, then finished it today. Not going to lie, it's good, but like it's a bit, a bit repetitive, you know, like it just keeps happening and happening, which I get that's what it's about. But I'm kind of over it now. If there's another series, I don't know whether I'll watch it because I'm kind of like, well, I know what's going to happen. Like everyone wants to psycho and kill people. Well, not everyone. You know what I mean? If you've watched it, then you'll get it. You'll get what I'm talking about. If you haven't watched it, watch it and then let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, that's basically all I've got to report right now. Um, other than that, nothing's happened. So sorry that I've got nothing else to say on this video, but the Colorado part of this video was fun, I hope. Um, that's the reality of moving abroad. Not, it's not, not every day is really exciting, unfortunately. Um, but that's it. I guess from this video because tomorrow's Friday so I'll start again on Friday for week six. Oh my gosh week six already that's crazy I still can't go with I've got, I've got no nails on look look I'll still be my fingers look I just can't get over it mm. but yeah I'll start tomorrow for week six which blows my mind um and that's that's it that is it that's all that's going on that's all that's going on right now um this weekend I've got quite a lot of uh fun stuff planned actually probably gonna go, to, go down to Santa Cruz for the weekend again and go exploring around Monterey and the, the coast so that should be nice but other than that this video has nothing else to report because as I said it's been a average week since getting back from Colorado so catch you on the next video thanks for watching hopefully by the next video I won't sound so bunged up um peace out